Hello everyone, welcome to Shemo Abacus Mental Math Learning Center. My name is Shelly Ben and I'm the principal coordinator for Shemo Education here in Nigeria. Let's face it, most children don't like math. I also didn't like math back then in school. Unfortunately, this trend is still going on in schools. Children have phobia when it comes to mathematics. Why is that so? This is because the approach that we use as teachers to educate our children on mathematics is all about the formulas on the board and the children going back home to figure out how to solve a math problem. And that's why we are here to introduce to you the Shemo Abacus Mental Math Program. How does the abacus integrate with the math subject? With the abacus, a child is able to understand what you are talking about when it comes to numbers and mathematical operation. The abacus makes the job easy for the teacher and also for the children. How does that work? With a lovely tool like the abacus that has the beads, the beam and the rods, the abacus has all the math operation in it. A child is able to see clearly the picture he or she is going to be adopting when it comes to maths. The children are able to understand counting from counting a child progresses to the math operations. The abacus is not just only for counting, it's also used to enhance the basic operations that we learn in maths. Addition, subtraction, multiplication, division, and even square roots. All of these operations are actually carried out on the abacus. Why does a child need to use the abacus when it comes to math? Usually, math is taught in an abstract form. Formulas are written on the board. A child sits down for a long period of time, looks at the formulas, and at times they get really bored. But with the abacus, you can actually make a child understand these formulas while the child is working on the abacus. Using the abacus can make a child develop mentally, physically, and psychologically. How is this possible? When a child works with the abacus for a long period of time, the child starts visualizing the abacus in his or her mind. In that way, the bead movements are easy for the child to manipulate. Now, this is how mental mass is usually done. When a child learns abacus mental math, their brains are being developed and they are able to concentrate highly in class. In this way, a child is able to picture the abacus in their mind and they are able to do mental math. Plus one, plus one, minus four, plus two, plus two, minus four, plus three, plus one, minus two, plus one. What do we have? Three. 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 That is correct. When children are learning abacus mental math go out for competitions, they don't even need the abacus anymore or even a calculator. They are able to visualize the abacus in their mind and give accurate results. Doing mental math is actually the goal for every child. Every child should be able to do mental math without a calculator or even without the abacus. The only way this can be made possible is when a child has a visual representation of the abacus in the mind. Here in Shemo Learning Center, we develop children on Saturdays on how to use the abacus to enjoy mathematics. And we also look out for schools that are also interested in developing their children when it comes to math. How can you bring us up on board? All you need to do is to give us 10 to 15 minutes of your time. We'll come around and do a short demo for your school, for your children, for your teachers, so you can have a clear view of what we are talking about. I hope you enjoyed this video and we hope to hear from you soon. Thank you.